chaps. Thursday, 10 a.m. I am feeling as rough as a dog's. <clears throat> anyway, so I've come in. I was almost so tempted. I almost stopped at home today, but I just thought to myself, well, one big push, let's get this best bitter in the tank. And then, you know, I've achieved my goal for the week. I've made 1,500 litres of beer. Um, and nothing else to report, really. I'm gonna crack on with the day, set the camera up where I can, as per usual. Uh, I don't really think there's gonna be too many other developments today. Um, apart from, uh, I'm gonna be placing an order with GC Supplies. Uh, we need to pick up some stainless fittings because I want to eventually plumb in the plate heat exchanger as a permanent fixture along with the pump. So I'm gonna build a little mount bracket at the side of the exchanger for the pump to sit on. And then we'll plumb it all in together. I think it'll look pretty dense, Nazaru. And while I'm ordering that, I'm also gonna be ordering some uh, stainless fittings for Tom. Um, he wants to bring his pots over uh, I think next Friday and we're going to see if we can get some element bosses installed to the side of these pots although having watched his most recent video yesterday I did look at those pots and I thought I bet the steel wall on those pots is really thin so it might be something that we have to uh, approach with much caution because we can put distortion into the stainless steel very, very easily. Um, so, might be a difficult weld. We'll see how we go on. If it's too difficult, we'll have to come up with another solution, like, uh, like a compression fitting, perhaps. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna order that stuff from GC Supplies today. It'll probably be here early next week, and then we'll be cracking on with, uh, with Tom's Pots on Friday. One thing I also wanted to mention as well, um, if you want to come across to the brew shed on the 1st of November, you really need to get your skates on and get your name down. There aren't many places left in Retford to stay overnight, so you might have to get on the Brewtubers page, speak to Tony Howard on there, um, possibly a few, other, other <laughs> a few of the other lads like John Campbell or something might be able to help you out in terms of, I don't know, bunking up in a room, sharing a room or something like that. I've not asked them about this, but you know, if you want to come, they're the people to talk to and you really need to get a room booked unless you're going to do um, a day visit, come for the day and then leave in the evening, which is totally fine. But 1st of December, they will all be descending on Retford. Hopefully I'll be in finer fettle by then. I hope so, because I've got a party on the weekend to go to. And uh, yeah, I'm making sure that we've got lots of IVB beers in the freaking brew shed for everybody to love, alongside all of those mega kegs that we've got in there. Anyway, I'm gonna get this best bitter mashed in and uh, cue the time lapse.
my, oh my, oh my. I don't often push myself like that. So, brew day done. It's half past five. I feel like I've pretty much killed myself doing these three back to back brew days. So, uh, I'm gonna have a little bit of a push this evening to edit the vlog. I've got some payments to make for the stainless steel that we're gonna do with Tom's Pots. And uh, I'm gonna go upstairs into the pub next door, sit down with a cheeky pint to take the edge off while I ring Gemma to come and pick me up and uh, I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna have tomorrow off, folks. You ain't gonna see me on the vlog until Tuesday unless something miraculous happens uh, because obviously I'll be able to film a vlog on Monday. It'll go up Tuesday morning. But yeah, I'm gonna take a long weekend and see if I can uh, if I can shake this um, this chest infection. It's kind of it's moved from a cold now, and it's all in here, and I don't like it. You know, I'm already an asthmatic, and uh, the worst thing I can have is uh, something you know on the lungs. Not a good situation. So thanks for tuning in this week, folks. It's been a funny one because it was hectic last week course getting the pub running but we've got tanks full of beer again time to settle recuperate recover take stock and kick off again when I finally shake this cold off like a bad case of fleas we'll see you next week <laughs>